Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lord. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day, guys. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that a lot of you guys are really enjoying the Thanos event in Fortnite Battle Royale. I know I am. I would never expected the Avengers to ever partner up with Fortnite in my whole entire life. I mean, it just was such an unlikely thing to happen. And um, I guess this happening actually gives us a little bit more perspective of where Fortnite hopes to go in the future of their actual game, you know? This could actually open up a lot of other sponsorship, co like kind of, uh, I guess, uh, opportunities for both, like, you know, different companies and Fortnite themselves. Uh, so what we're actually going to be doing in today's video is going over four franchises that I would love to see Fortnite combine with in the future for some kind of event. And I'm pretty sure that a lot of you guys would very much agree with these. Um, maybe apart from one, but that's only my personal opinion. Uh, but anyway, before we do get into the video, guys, please do not forget to leave a like. And also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite glitches, guides, videos just like this, including a couple of giveaways here and there when I can actually afford them. Talking about the giveaways, I do have a 10,000 V-Bucks giveaway going on at the minute. Go into the description below and click on the top link and it'll give you all of the details that you need to know on how to participate in the actual giveaway itself. Uh, but anyway, let's get into talking about these four franchises I would love to see merge with Fortnite Battle Royale. So we're going to start off with a very obvious one, and it has been talked about for quite a bit since the Thanos event was actually leaked and everything like that, and that is a DC slash Fortnite crossover, and as you can see on screen right now, I've done a kind of concept art of what this would kind of look like. I know, like, Superman looks a little bit weird there, I don't know, it looks like he's having a bit of a stroke, but uh, basically, it's got Superman here on the DC side, and obviously the Omega character on the right, with the background of Gotham, with the bat signal kind of lighting up. I think this looks really cool to be honest. I, I When I made this I was like, I can't believe I've made this. That's actually pretty cool. But considering that they've actually just made a deal with Marvel themselves, it would make sense for DC to kind of think, well do you know what? That was a really good opportunity for those to do that. And considering that Epic Games, uh, the parent company of Epic Games actually owns a little bit of DC character kind of uh, I guess uh, the rights to them, it would make sense for them to allow them to use a DC crossover over sometime in the future and I don't really know how this exactly would work I mean personally the Thanos game mode is really good and it's really fought out and I think that mostly any other franchise would work with this kind of thing um, and I think you know it could actually re just replace Thanos with uh, Darkseid, I think his name is. And if you don't know what he looks like, he's on screen right now. And he is basically like the DC's version of Thanos, to be honest. And I don't know. I would just love to see some kind of crossover in the future. Maybe even a Flash crossover. I think that would be really cool. Like, a really cool way to introduce, like, fast kind of uh, consumables, like a juice that you drink and all of a sudden you can run quite fast and everything. I don't know, but I think that it would work really well, whatever they decide to do. And I know for a fact a lot of people have been asking for this, so you know what? I thought, why not add in a DC and Fortnite crossover to my list? Uh, the next one that we're going to be moving over to is, uh, is actually one, again, from Disney, and it is on screen right now. And uh, as you can see, it is a Star Wars slash Fortnite crossover. And uh, yeah, the, the, the custom art of this, or I guess the graphical art of this isn't that great, to be honest. But still, you know, the whole concept is there. You know, how cool would it be to be Darth Vader in Fortnite with maybe a lightsaber instead of, you know, the Thanos glove and attack people in a same similar game type as the Infinity Gauntlet. But maybe we couldn't call it, we, we, we could call it like lightsaber or something, you know, something along those lines lines where, you know, a lightsaber would be found across the map somewhere, you pick it up, and then boom, you're Darth Vader himself. And this would make sense because, of course, the Avengers is owned by uh, Disney themselves, and if Disney thinks that the crossover of the Thanos thing went well, maybe they could say, well, you know what? We've got a Star Wars movie coming out soon. How about we just kind of let them use Darth Vader and put him into the game? And you know what? I think it would work really well. I mean, I would really love that kind of thing added to this game. Uh, just because I'm kind of a Star Wars fan in myself anyway. But um, this is actually, like, the reason I thought up of this whole video was because I thought, you know what? How cool would it be if Marvel did this for a Star Wars movie? Because 
um, I guess Disney's top two franchises at the minute is the Avengers and Star Wars, I guess, because of all the new Star Wars movies that are coming out. And uh, I don't know. I thought it would be cool, and I hope that a lot of you guys would agree with me on that. Uh, but anyway, let us move on to another one, and uh, this one is my own personal opinion. I mean, I, I've not ha heard anyone say this before, but I would love to see an old Epic Games game collaborate with Fortnite, and this game is called Gears of War. Now, Gears of War is actually the very first game that got me into online gaming, and it's basically a post-apocalyptic game where you have these locusts attacking the humans, and the humans are trying to uh, save their own lives. You know, they're sh trying to save humanity. And uh, some of the characters that you get in this franchise are really cool. Uh, one being the one on screen right now, as you just saw, which is Clayton Carmine from the third Gears of War movie uh, game, I guess. And uh, what's really crazy about this is that there is a Gears of War movie coming out in the future that could possibly benefit from this crossover. I mean, never say never. I mean, obviously, Epic Games once owned Gears of War. Unfortunately, now the Gears of War franchise is not owned by Epic Games. I believe it, it, it's owned by Mar uh, Microsoft Studios themselves. But what was really cool is that the head of Gears of War, who is, I believe, called Rod Ferguson, actually tweeted out to Monster Hunter developers the other day and said, what do we have to do to get a Brumac in Monster Hunter? And Monster Hunter is a game, basically does what it says, you hunt monsters. And uh, one really kind of cool character in the Gears of War franchise is the Brumac, and he's going to be on screen right now. And is this big, huge dinosaur looking creature. And I just think something like this would be really cool in Fortnite. Even if it was just for a week, a limited time mode or something like that, I would absolutely love a Brumac in this game. Now, if not a Brumac, it would be really cool if they added in one of the kind of evil people from Gears of War, such as General Ram or maybe Scourge. I don't know. I think that would be really cool. But considering that the Epic Games company had ties with Rod Ferguson in the past, it just makes sense. I mean, they, they can't hate each other, you know, just because they somebody sold out the company. It, it, like, you know, it, they have to still like each other and there must be some sort of collaboration that has to be in the works here in the background. I mean, I just feel like something's happening in the background. Now, obviously, we don't know about it because the Fortnite developers are very secretive, but... I don't know, I would love if if that meteorite in the middle of Dusty Divot kind of cracked open one day and then boom, it was General Ram or a Brumac or something. That would make me very, very happy, especially that big dinosaur footprint. I mean, how cool would that be if that was actually like a Brumac's footprint, you know? I don't know, it could all tie in in many different ways that would make sense. And I would just love to see these two franchises cross over. Um, but anyway, what we're going to do is move on to the very last kind of uh, crossover that a lot of people have been saying that they would love to see. Personally, for me, I think it's a bit ridiculous, but um, it is on screen right now. And as you can see, it is a Jurassic World and Fortnite crossover. I've actually used the dinosaur from a cartoony kind of looking uh, movie because, you know, it goes with the kind of same theme as, you know, Fortnite. It looks a little bit cartoony. But obviously, this kind of started with the footprint in the game. You know, a lot of people were like, oh my god, dinosaurs were coming. They're going to keep be here. They're going to do some sort of like L LTM event. And you know what? Now with this huge Thanos event that just happened, I mean, it would make sense. It would actually make sense if Jurassic World or, you know, the people who own Jurassic, uh, the, the Jurassic World franchise was to be like, you know what, Fortnite? How about we add in a dinosaur into your game or something like that? I don't necessarily know how this would work, I'll be honest with you, but I've seen so many people on the Fortnite Reddit going crazy about this possibility, and I thought, you know what, it would make a really cool kind of a uh, top four to actually add into this video. So, I don't know. If you did enjoy this video, guys, tell me in the comment section below what your favorite kind of crossover is, and if it isn't in this video, comment it down below. I would love to know what kind of crossover crossovers and franchises you would love to see work with Fortnite in the future. My neighbor's alarm is going off right now. I feel like punching them in the face. But uh, yeah, I, I guess I'm going to call this video a wrap and say I hope that you all enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, just have an awesome day, guys. Enjoy the gameplay in the background. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.